What's up everyone? Today it's Friday, September the 16th. That means we are two weeks out of our first Bundesliga competition. Uh, and I've been uh, dealing with some issues. Uh, I still have a little bit of neck pain. I didn't inform you of that. Um, that was before I went on holiday. Well, I didn't really went on holiday, but I just stayed home and just chilled there. Uh, but like two weeks pri prior to that, um, my neck started hurting. Uh, for some reason, I like twitched something in there. Uh, it's not really my neck, it's down here. Um, like in the, in the trap area. Um, so I thought like in the in the holiday it would it would just pass and it would uh, it would get better you know, uh, but unfortunately it didn't really. Uh, I still have some issues with that and also some nagging shoulder pain. Uh, as you could see in my first video, uh, I did a lot of handstands and uh, I was just pretty weak at that also. Uh, but apparently my shoulder there was something with my shoulder. And that's why I was just very weak at that. And also doing that so much in the training and the training sessions after that probably wasn't very good for it. So now I took rest uh, from my shoulder, from handstands and pushing and all that stuff uh, for like three weeks. And now I'm slowly building up with handstands and doing some power uh, training for it again to make it stronger. But I have been doing floor and high bar. Um, I will show you some of the high bar training that I did yesterday. Yesterday I did like half routines, not really half routines, but um, just uh, like three, four elements of my routine. Uh, and then the other three, two elements, whatever. Um, so yeah, my shoulder doesn't really affect my uh, performance at the Bundesliga, at least I hope. Uh, but my neck uh, is causing me to uh, not be able to do like stallers and endos very good on high bar. So we'll see uh, what we will do with that. Probably no stallers, uh, but I will do the endo after the Yamawaki. Uh, it's a little bit easier of a routine than on the Dutch Nationals uh, because then it's just more stable and with the Bundesliga competition it's just really important that you hit your routine. So I will do high bar, floor and vault. Uh, vault has been going pretty good as well and floor too. Uh, today in the afternoon I will do floor again. Uh, it will be also a little bit of an easier routine than on the Dutch Nationals uh, and I've already trained this morning. I did some uh, shoulder rehab and just the usual trampoline stretching and ankle uh, and ankle stuff. Uh, shoulder rehab is really important now because I have to make my shoulder strong again um, and be able to do the hands. So right now we are two weeks out of our first competitions. There are a total of seven competitions so that's quite a lot. Uh, I'm hoping to do all of them. Uh, we have two other guys, Christoph Schwe and Jorian Ilbrink. Uh, they're from my club and they also um, compete at the Bundesliga with me. And the first competition is with Jorion and he will do pommel horse, p-bars and rings. So then we have an, a full all round. So with every competition, uh, I will do three apparatus and the other person will also do three apparatus. And then we have a full all round. Then uh, we have also three other guys, three other German guys on every apparatus, uh, which uh, fill in. So every apparatus has four gymnasts of each team. So from now on, I will definitely keep you guys updated with uh, the elements that I will be trying to do in the Bundesliga and just show you guys how my routines are going. Uh, this Monday I will actually start full routines so this should be pretty cool. Uh, I'm thinking about maybe uh, doing something like uh, I did with the Reviving the All Rounder that I just sit in my room and uh, like give commentary on the whole week uh, or I might just do uh, like these separate vlogs. Uh, it's kind of up to you what you guys want to see. And then I will also make a separate video for the competition. So every week I will do a competition, but then you also have the training for the next competition. So hopefully I will get much more consistent as the competitions continue and maybe make some progress in difficulty score and all that good stuff. So yeah, I'm really, really excited. Uh, right now I'm gonna eat some broccoli, my favorite. And then I'll see you guys in the afternoon training. Peace. Last name ever, first name created. Like a sprained ankle, boy, I ain't nothing to play. Started off local, but thanks to all the haters, I know G4 pilots on a first name basis. They hit it off the ground. Nino, got more class. class. We know, swimming in the money, come and find me. Nemo, if I was at the club, you know I ball. Chemo, dropping shit sounded like an album. Who'd have thought a countrywide tour would be the outcome? Labels want my name.
about to, you about to, you about to kill him. I used to have hood dreams, big fame, big chains. Stuck my dick inside his life until that bitch came. I went hard on fall like the ball team. Just so I could make it rain on spring. Y'all seen my story, my glory. I have ripped the game young. You can call it statutory when a nigga blow up. They gon' build statues for me. Old money, Benjamin Button. What? Nothing. Now a super bad chick's giving me make love. And do a think I ran. This is what happens when you do P-bars after like two months of not doing P-bars. Not really a smart idea, but you know, we'll get over it. Probably not gonna do high bar right now, but tomorrow it should be healed up a little bit again. So try to do high bar tomorrow. All right guys, that's it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Uh, and I'll see you guys on the next episode. I don't really know when it is, uh, but next week uh, I will definitely do full routines and I'll keep you guys posted. Peace.